GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zila, and we're here today doing the Alpha 11 series with the Alpha or with the uh, Invader Defender scenario. And I seem to have bugs all around. There's bugs everywhere. They they keep popping my. I'm going to have to go kill a bunch of them because I, I've, I've been putting up these panels and they keep somehow destroying my drone. Like three times now, they've actually smashed my drone and, and popped it. It's like, really? Wow. They're sneaky little buggers and they can just all of a sudden like, boom! <laughs> the drone just, boom! <laughs> uh, it's nerve-wracking. Anyway, we're going to attempt to put in the rest of the panels. And what else are we going to do today? We're going to get uh, more of the base built. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So what I did is I switched a bunch of blocks over to this building now. So that it's easier to stay connected to. Uh, I can also, what I should do is, is make a bunch of, a whole bunch of Wi-Fi. And then do the connect to... Uh, shipyard and then place them all out as far as possible and then do the same thing with this base and then the same thing with the third base that we're going to do uh, the only problem is I don't want to do that to the third base yet until I put down the um, until I put down the base starter so I think we should actually get that place today uh, so let's let's grab that out of the shipyard. There we go. So we want. I had a base starter, yeah. Okay. So we're gonna do the connect to this, connect to resonance, and then oh come on, weather really. Are you really going to do this when we're building again? Oh my god. Wow. Whoa. That's some awesome lightning though. Okay. Well, we'll have a lightning show while we build. So I got to get down there and place a block for this base so that we can place the starter for the other base up against it. I basically want to get as far possible as I can down there by the water. So, I think for safety purposes, you know what, I got guns on me, I got guns on me, I can, it doesn't, it's not that scary, is it? How much, what do I got? Yeah, I got lots of ammo. Okay, I know there's, the crickets around here, so we we should be able to avoid them. I just can't see while I'm there. Yeah, we'll pick these while we can. Why not? Free XP. Free XP. It's kind of silly me walking down here, but. Uh, Okay, I got to... Oh, I'm going to disconnect. No, 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 Come on, come on, come on. Okay. So let's get these out. Um, okay, how far? No, no, no. Don't do that. How far? Okay, so we're we're golden. We can place that here. Okay, good. I was getting a little worried that we might get a little too far. And then this should say when we start getting too far, right? Like when we start getting too far from the Wi-Fi. Residence 118? Hmm. Is it broken? Like it shouldn't, we shouldn't have the Wi-Fi all the way here. Not yet, anyway. Well, I'm going to take advantage of this. Oh, there we go. Uh, 134. That's fine. We should be okay here, then. 
You know what? We're really close. Darn. Let's try and do this. We'll do it right there then. Okay. And then we'll grab. Well, I guess we could. This is really dangerous. Why am I down here? Give ourselves a little bit of open ground. The only problem is raptors are going to come. These, see, there's a cricket there. Let's deal with him. He's probably the... Oh, really? You're going to give us a, a fake thing? Okay, so let's... Come on. Whoa, he looks very close. <laughs> and I suck. Ugh. Can't hear anything because of the rain. Okay, so let's get that starter block. And get it connected right up beside here. that down come on one more that looks perfect right there there we go okay okay excellent so now that is on the same level yeah I know okay so let's go make a bunch of Wi-Fi I think now now that I've got a base starter connected that's all I needed I just needed to get that base starter down. And yeah, leave me alone. I'll just leave you guys alone. We'll just, we'll just, we'll just ignore what I did down there to your buddy. Okay. Well, we can get up this and they can't yet. Huh, I wonder if I should actually bring that all the way down. They'll end up starting to crawl up here and crawl all over the base if I do that. I don't know. I don't know if I want that. Huh. And I gotta figure out how we're gonna actually get down to that base. I'm thinking truthfully, over here. A ramp down. Right over there. And then We'll make like a road that comes down through. Because it's all kind of flat land there. I think it would be kind of feasible. You know, clear clear a bunch of stuff. It'll just, or we can just make a ramp anyway. Get a HV going. It's kind of funny. We don't even have an HV going. We're almost level 25. I've never done that before. I don't think in the game where... I didn't build an HV at least by the time I was level 20. Okay, so now that uh, those are connected, I think what we should do is get some more Wi-Fi. Um, connected around, so we need to make some more, so let's spawn my drone I'll just look at this base going to the advanced constructor so uh, you know we'll make 10 of them because now that we got the base starter down we can we can expand from that one Oh yeah, it's a couple. That's all we need right now. It's good enough. Okay. And we don't need this right now. Okay. So, oh, wait. Yes, we do. Derp a derp. Let's go like this. Because I want the shipyard. Uh, we're just going to do a connect to. Connect to shipyard. Okay, so now I don't need, now I can put you away. Okay, 
I know it's a little cumbersome doing these bases like this, but they are quite kind of expansive for not really very much CPU, but you know, that's the only way to make massive bases now without killing yourself with CPU. Make a whole bunch of them, a whole bunch of medium sized ones instead of one big one. Okay, so now this will be interesting. We'll see how far we can get with this. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Just avoiding the uh, wildlife. Yeah, it's going to let us uh, go quite far with this, I think. Okay, good. And we can also, for, for right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use lifts. Connect it to that one. That way we're not going to lose our, our Wi-Fi. Okay, so now this should be the other base. This should still be the shipyard that it's letting me put a Wi-Fi down for. Yeah, I wonder if we can bury this in the water. That would be uber. Okay, so let's just bear it. Oh, let's get the heck out of the water. <laughs> yeah, I see you. I see you. You're coming right at me. I know. Can lasers shoot through water? Let's see. No, I don't think so. Oh, they can shoot down through water, though. So they, okay, so they can shoot down through water. Oh, what was that? What was that? I'm hearing noises over here now. Uh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, there's some tentacles over there. See that? See that? A bunch of them. Wow. Okay, so this is going to be an interesting spot to build. Yeah, get the heck out of here. Oh! I killed him. I killed him. Oh, get the heck out of the water, though. Yeah, see that? See that guy right, right on my butt. Oh, reload. Why oh, you pissed at me? Huh? Come at me, bro. Come at me. Come at me, bro. You come at me? Oh yeah, you're coming at me. Yeah, bad move. That was a bad move on your part, let me tell you. Okay, you can see now I actually have two Wi-Fi connections right now. So one of them should be the shipyard. These guys were so rude to interrupt me. So I got the residence, right? Because that's the one Wi-Fi on top of the block. It should be the residence. And then the other one should be shipyard. Yep. Because that was the one... That's the, the one I'm connected to right now uh, for my N construction connection. But because I place this on top of this block, which happens to be the residence block, then I also have extended that Wi-Fi to whatever this area now too. Oh, okay. Just, Jesus. Holy crap, these things are tough. Level 5. Wow. Still only worth 320 XP. So yeah, that's excellent. Uh, what we could do too is we can just stick a Wi-Fi on that right, a, right away too. Oh, did I not grab them? That's okay. We can go into here now, right? That's the sweet thing. We can go into here. And, um, you know, we should, what we really need to do is we're, we'll put a remote console for each. Yeah, that's all I need to do. Damn, that's brilliant. I'll put a remote console. 
Oh, I should have done that right on there. Um, yeah. I could have even put that like right here. You know what? Maybe I will. Maybe I will just for just for fun. Let's do the remote console right here because that way we can construct. Yeah, yeah, this is cool. This will be thematic. Um, okay, so I got to make sure that it's if I if I don't if I, as long as I'm not looking at that block when I place it won't connect to it. It'll it should stay connected to shipyard. So if I'm looking at the ground there, boom. And now if I look at the block, see how perfectly aligned that is too. By the way, see what I'm telling you? This works really well when you when you line it up like that. Like I just showed you here with the core. So this is the other two bases. This one should now be the shipyard. Let's look at it. And shipyard, yep. This one over here. And this. Oh, did I hear footsteps? Whew. This game freaks me out sometimes. No, okay. Anyway. This one here should be the residence. Yep. Because that was the residence block right there. See that? And now this one here is unnamed, which we're going to name now. Okay, this is going to be the processing, water purification, water collection. So uh, pro processing plant, processing. Um watershed call it the uh, processing plant I don't know I don't I don't necessarily like that name Meh. you know we'll think about it we'll think about it right now it's just named base that's fine okay um, so because now that we have a block down here we should be able to like look at it and get into the advanced constructor. Yep. Okay. I kind of want to make that a little bit more believable. So let's... Do we have any consoles we can put in there? Yep. Uh... So what going to do is we're going to have I know this is out in the middle of nowhere but we're going to go like this and then so now we actually have a console so we can get into uh, oh oh put it up against see that it went into the wrong I was looking at the wrong one it connected to residence okay so it's not actually connected to the block it's on it's connected to the block it's touching so we got to remove that and you got to be careful <laughs> these bases like this get very complicated because they are lined up so perfectly that you don't actually know sometimes which it's like oh so the only way to tell is by actually going into the control panel while looking at the block to actually tell which one it is. So uh, be careful that way. So let's let's redo that. Um, if we look at this block this time, actually, you know what? I'm going to spin this around because I think I want to do. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make it seem like we have a little work area here. could extend the shipyard a little bit <laughs> extend the shipyard that's funny um, actually no that'll be fine we can look at that let's now connect to base instead and from here let's jump up on top yeah we're fine we're fine. We should be able to hear stuff sneaking up on us. And a cricket, 
the cricket will get a shot off on us for sure, but you know, whatever. Here, let's go into this view. Um, so what we want is we want it not quite in the water, right? Well, yeah, I guess we do want it looking into the water. Sure. Like actually coming, going into the water. Yeah, we do want that. And then, uh, okay, so where, where are we going to do this then? So we want, should I put down the, should I put down the water generators first? I got to make more. Okay, let's make some more. Okay, that's constructor. We want a couple more water generators, please. Make three more. It'll be overkill, but whatever. Okay. Kind of risky out in the open, but whatever. Doesn't seem to be a lot of predators around here, so that's handy. The predators seem to be up in the really heavily wooded areas. Uh, other, I mean, other than the, the tentacle monsters. But <laughs> yeah, so I think I want this up a little higher, right? And then we'll have a, a little sunken room. That would go down into to get to get to the water generators. So let's um, yeah, I need to place the generators first though, because they won't place once you dig the crap out. It won't place properly. So, but if if you place them first and then dig and, and put your blocks, then it's all good. <laughs> I'll keep working. Okay, are they done? They should be done. They should be ready. Yep. Okay, so let's put these down. We can. We can place these with the drone. It doesn't matter. Uh, although we have to do the, we have to disconnect from. Okay, it doesn't say that we're connected, but I think we still are. Yeah. Okay. How do we? How do we disconnect from there? There. Okay. Not very intuitive, eh? I had to connect to another one first and disconnect to it to get the... <laughs> I'm like, what? Why isn't it? Okay. Uh, I mean, really, are we going to go much further out than that? Not really. This should be just fine. I just want these to line up with each other. That's the goal I'm looking for here, so that nice oh that's actually pretty hard to do get that to line up fairly evenly like that right on the shoreline like that too i like it i like it i probably won't have to go super deep then so now we've got to reconnect to uh base okay yeah, if I was connected to any sort of base, it won't let you place standalone uh, devices like water generators and crap like that. So, okay. Uh, where is it going to want to place? It wants to place right there, eh? Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yep, we'll do that. Uh, we got to smash a rock out. That's fine. Um, that'll go up now. Or is that actually a little too early for it to come up? No, because I'm going to have to dig. Okay, so can this just come across now? 
Let's do that. Let's do that. I like that. That'll work. Okay. So, like I was saying, the uh, processing plant is not going to be a big, massive structure either. Okay, we've got to knock these rocks out and other stuff, foliage. Okay. Come on. Well, we'll have some digging to do. I just didn't want to dig a lot. Yeah. We got some smashing to do here. Okay. I guess I could have just smashed the rocks with the, uh, doesn't really matter. <laughs> I could have done it with my uh, drill, right? So, by just, like, harvesting them. Okay, where was that? This guy, it's, it's getting dark. That means we should probably call it an episode pretty quick here. So I'll just get rid of uh, these rocks real quick and we can just, we'll just destroy that I don't care okay oops whoops okay Gotta have a little bit better aim. So it doesn't dig a big frickin' you know, rocks are still falling through the yep, we got falling through the train, that sucks. Nope, oh, that time it didn't. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can place now. Keep an eye out for critters. Excellent. Excellent. And then... God, we could just like... Oh, that'd be cheesy. Yeah, a little... No, let's do it more. Let's do at least one more then. That under there. Nice. And then, oh, perfect. Okay, well, we got a good start on the uh, processing water generator, water storage. So this is where we're going to generate water. We're going to store the water. We're going to have the um, furnace and deconstructor in this building here. Um, yeah. And then I'm not sure yet if I'm going to do a paved roadway up through there. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe it'll require... The only problem is, is the CPU points. I think whatever base has the least amount of CPU, we'll have, to, we'll have to connect to that one and build from until it starts getting a little ridiculous. And we can use all three bases to build the road that way and kind of distribute the, the CPU. Okay, so if I want to build any more... Oh, oh what's going on? Yeah, yeah, you're going to get lippy. Okay. 
I'm going to call it an episode here, guys. Uh, it's getting dark, so I'm going to head back, and, and we're going to sleep for the night. Now let's grab our gun, or a gun. This one, this one. We'll reload. Oh, we can pick everything again. Wow. That grew fast. Okay. And there's usually a critter under there. No. Oh, I'll show you what I'm doing with the piping here. I actually had to construct something to actually hold up the... Um, so I'm going to continue with that theme. i got to, like, dig that out, run the piping down, or I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure yet. i got to figure that out. But I had to put some bracing in to hold those up. Well, we never did put the other ones in, because I'm not sure if I want to. Uh, did it get any battery power? Let's take a look. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it charged up pretty good. 232. That's not bad. That'll probably hold through the night quite easily, considering it's almost keeping up at night with the current demand. But that's going to skyrocket once I start putting all the gear in here the, the um yeah it'll be living on fuel basically it might be able to live off the the uh, solar during the day but yeah it's not gonna it's not gonna generate a lot of um charge i doubt it's gonna consume a lot okay well i just wanted to get back over here so that i could put all this stuff in the oh actually i didn't need to i can i could have connected to it anyway so let's just do that throw that all inside we'll eat that we'll eat that and do we actually have a yeah we've got a bunch of these let's um let's just for now um I'm just going to temporarily put that down and call it a night. Well, next episode, we will continue building. Until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.